Hey guys, Mr. Light is back with Prisoner of War. So, we got the boot polish from, uh, from, um, the, there's so many characters in this game, I keep forgetting the rank of the different part characters, so, for the next part of the game, we need to go to the store, and get, uh, sorry about the screen, I know my recording device is not being very sensible again, it might seem to say a bit yellow at the moment. Basically, we need to get the store key. Good morning, gentlemen. I am delighted to see you all so eager to face the day. Dismissed. Don't know what that was. Just heard something crash on the ground. I'll sort that later. So, we will get the keys of the storehouse. So that then, uh... We can get into their storehouse and get a crowbar to break into the truck area. So we can get a truck out of here. But to do that, we first need to wait till morning exercise to pull off this plan. So what we're going to do first is speak to our little gang here. What will you be needing, Captain? I've got to get a key from the German barracks. Any tips? A key? Oh, I wouldn't know about that. But I'll tell you this. Before you go through a door, it's best to check through the keyhole first. Tripping over a German guard can really ruin your day. That is definitely true. That's all you know? Sorry, but I've never had the patience for all that sneaking around. Try Clancy. He's got more training in that field. Well, from what we heard... Well, boot polish is great. Got anything else? Actually, I do. Take a look at this telescope. It's not much, but it's great for spying on guards, especially up the towers. It's yours for 20 currency. Haven't got that Very at the moment. Time. Your choice. Let me know if you change your mind. So how did you meet Clancy? Clancy? We got thrown in the same camp a couple of years ago. I supplied him with tools and the like for his escape plans. He supplied me with currency, and we've been friends ever since. I wish you could have seen him back then. Scourge of the guards he was. Oh, wait, you see what we're going to do to everyone? Like Clancy, old oh boy? What can I do for you, Captain? Hey, Clancy, you know how to get to the German barracks? Well, it's just north of the mess hall over the fence. But if you want to get in, you'll have to distract the guard. He's posted outside all day. All day? How about at night? Whoa, are you kidding? At night, the whole place is full of snoring crowds. Yeah, bad well, idea. I guess you might be okay if you moved real slow and quiet. That's assuming you could get past the searchlights in the first place. Have you picked up any tips on avoiding the guards? These days, I don't bother. But in my heyday, I was near invisible. It's all about staying crouched, moving slowly. And using objects around you for cover. Boy, was I good. I'll speak to you later. Okay, and finally, our good friend, JD. These guards don't look so smart. Let me know when you're ready to sniff around the barracks, and I'll make sure they're looking the other way. Morning exercise has to be the best time. JD, how about you go check out that store? Hey, would you give me a break? I only just got here. But I'll see what I can do. You ready to get the crowds off of my back? I say we stick to the plan and wait till morning exercise. I'll speak to you later. Okay, so that's basically the goal here. We now have to wait until morning exercise, which thankfully is right after breakfast. Mm. Pardon me. So after this, breakfast we're having where we're just moving around inside we're not actually doing anything unbelievably you don't even eat during this time you just stay around doing whatever okay morning exercise is next this is where we're gonna have to pull off a little um working time 
You just gotta wait for breakfast to end and for morning exercise to begin. It'll be happening soon. I hope. Yeah, the waiting around can get a little annoying. So, move to exercise yard. And the exercise yard is this place here. So what we want to do, we want to wait just a bit. Till we can get over to that building right there over the other side of the fence. Now... Where's JD? It's not morning exercise yet, sadly. We just gotta wait for morning exercise to begin. Just gotta wait around until we can do this. Okay, morning exercise. Here we go. Hey, boss. You ready to get the Krauts off of my back? Good to go, boss. Leave the guards to me. You go check out the Krauts barracks. Come and find me when you've got that key. Okay, as you wish. Okay, he's gonna go over there. So I gotta go over here now and wait. Here we go. Get over here. Do I go in there? Careful. Okay, we're in the barracks. The key is right here, I believe. The brass key, okay. Now let's grab that. I believe that's... Oh no, there's some more currency over there. We can go pick that up as well. So we've got 40 currency. That's good. Now the thing is, out here... The guard's right there, but... Amazingly, he doesn't notice we're sneaking out. Made it. Doesn't even know we did it. Let's talk to JD again. Hey, boss. The key's ours. Nice going. I'll come find you after lights out. So we did it. So we can get into that tool store now, but sneaking past the guards can be tough. Tough, yes. Impossible, no. Oh. No. In fact, your good buddy JD did a dry run earlier. And I'll tell you how. Oh, wow, here we go. All ears. Looks like at some point a truck hit the surrounding wall and the Krauts haven't gotten around to patching up the hole. That's where you got through? Okay. Sure Had to crouch down a little and keep an eye on the guard tower. Any patrols? Two. But they tend to stop off for a chat each time they meet, so I slip past then. Simple as that, huh? Almost. There's one other guy patrolling around the store. Had to duck behind some logs to avoid that fella. JD, you're good, but I'm better. Bet I could do it in half the time. We'll see about that, won't we? Morning roll call! Oh boy. Step in the roll call area. We'll skip that because we've already seen it. Now what I want to do is go back in here and I want to... No, no, don't want that, don't want that. We will use this. Oh, you have to say, okay. This is a little awkward saving during my time, but we'll get round to it event. We'll just have to put up with that for this gameplay. Saving that. Then go to evening roll call. Right. It's the evening now. It's dark out.
You have to watch this. Good evening, gentlemen. I hope you all had a pleasant day. Dismissed. Yeah, we're dismissed. See ya, buddy. Right, let's go. It's night time. It's quite dark out. It's going to be pretty difficult to see things. Which I apologise for in advance. We take the boot polish. We go to the mirror. We are now... Almost invisible to the in the dark. Now what you want to do... It's kind of hard to see, but I'll explain as we go along. Sneak by until you're at the corner of this uh, building. There's a guard over there who's coming round the corner. He's on the other side of the gate, so at the moment he can't see me. Because he's too far away. And I'm hiding behind here. When he goes the other way... Hurry. Okay, now go through this hole in the wall. I can get to it. Oh, it's here. Okay, I got it. So we're here on this side. Uh, don't go too close to that wall to the left. Now here's a thing about this that I've actually discovered. First off, the watchtower won't notice you Unless you're actually in the spotlight. So there's no worries there. The guard that's patrolling around, it's night time, right? At this time, at night time... If you wait, yeah. See his, the light on him has gone down by quite a lot? That means he's gone to sleep. And now we can sneak in here, because he's gone to sleep. Grab some currency, even though we don't actually need it. And grab the crowbar, which we have now nicked. Now we got to get back to JD. I need to be careful here. The guard's going to come back, isn't he? Yeah, he's coming back this way. You can see on the map. If you can't see properly, you might have to rely on the map. Sorry about that, but... One of the downsides is how dark the game is at night. Okay, turn around. Go back over the fence. Now we gotta get by the guard over here and get back into our barracks. There we go. Come on. Okay. So we've actually managed to pull it off. So what I'm gonna do now, put the crowbar into there along with the brass key. Take this disguise off and put that in there too. And you know what, ladies and gentlemen? I'm stopping the video here. In the next episode, we're going to go and report back to JD that we've got the crowbar. And then we're going to make our getaway by sneaking into the truck depot and hiding away in the truck. So thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys next episode.